write the first five terms of the following sequence. It looks like we're going to start at 1 because we're told n is greater than or equal to 1. So we'll start by replacing all of the n's with 1's. So a sub 1 is negative 2 to the first power, which is just negative 2. Now, negative 2 to the n can be written as negative 1 times 2 and the whole thing to the nth power. And then you can use the properties of exponents to write this as negative 1 to the n times 2 to the n. Okay, so whenever you have an even number here, you're going to have an even number here. And negative 1 to an even number is 1. And negative 1 to an odd number is negative 1. So in other words, when we plug in an even number here, we're going to get a positive answer. If we plug in a negative number, we're going to get a negative answer. So let's keep going, keeping that in mind. So a sub 2 is negative 2 squared. That's even, so we're going to get a positive 4. That's the whole point of me doing all this, I guess. Uh, a sub 3, it's negative 2 cubed, but 3 is odd, so we're going to get a negative answer. a sub 4 is negative 2 to the 4th. That's even, so we'll get a positive answer. Why? Because you can do this, and then you get negative 1 to the 4th, which is 1, because 4 is even. And then finally, a sub 5 is negative 2 to the 5th power. 5 is odd, so you get a negative answer, which is negative 32. So the final answer is negative 2, 4, negative 8, 16, and negative 32. Those are the first five terms of the sequence.